this is going to be a very quick and easy video. It is going to be posted as part of my fourth article in my self-care series on reducing stress and anxiety during a rote interpretation. And that article touches on some different ways to manage your ringtone uh, on incoming calls. Because as I'm sure you're aware, if you've done rote interpretation, or if you've ever taken a phone call in your life, which I imagine you have, jarring ringtones are just, well, they're startling. And they're anxiety-inducing. They're just really startling. But anyways, uh, unfortunately, my desktop voiceover IP service that I use, which is Nextiva, which I highly recommend, you can select your own ringtones. However, it only accepts WAV file formats, which is kind of an antiquated file format. And most of the ringtones that I found were in were MP3 files, MP3 files. So I have this program open. It's called VLC Media Player. If you haven't heard of it, it is fantastic. It stands for Very Large Cone. It's actually quite a small cone on the screen, but regardless, it's called Very Large Cone Media Player, VLC Media Player. It is free. Uh, so you open the program, you go to Media, Convert slash Save, or you can just hold down Control R. And I've actually already added it here, but I'm going to remove it just so I can show you how to add it. So you just go to Add. And then I'm going to select Whisper Woman by Paul Gastold. Okay. So we have our file here. This is the list of files to be processed. You go down to convert slash save and you click the little carrot here. Uh, the little arrow pointing downwards, the carrot. You click on it, go to convert. And you'll see, uh, don't really need to pay attention to anything up here except for where it says profile. So it's going to try and convert it to a video, which is kind of counterproductive here. We're going to scroll down to the audio section and we're going to select CD. So CD is actually going to convert it to a WAV file format. Now you don't have to do this part here, but I just want to show you. You can edit the selected profile by clicking the little wrench there and you'll see here it says WAV. It's a WAV file format that we're going to be converting into. And then you select your destination file. So you're going to go down to the bottom, click on Browse, and this is a folder. I've actually done multiple takes of this video, and I've converted this song multiple times, this ringtone multiple times. Um, so we're just going to call this Whisper Woman Final. <laughs> Hit Save, and I want you to pay attention to right down here. So you click on Start. Did you see it? It changed very quickly. It's already converted the file. So I'm going to go down to my file explorer. And hey, sure enough, Whisper Woman Final is right here. 